Hello everyone, today we will cover how to use Tails OS with VirtualBox. Now if you are not aware, Tails OS is one of the most private operating systems that you can try on your computer. This is not an operating system that you can use on a daily basis to add software, files and personal documents. What this is more of a portable operating system that will protect you against surveillance and censorship. You can flash it to USB use it then once you check off the usb from your computer all the data will be wiped and you will have a clean operating system for the next time just like trying a linux operating system without installing it first now to use Tails os with virtualbox or vimware first click on get Tails. as you can see you can use it on windows mac linux and for virtualbox and virtual machine software Click on Run Tails in Virtual Machine. From here you can download the ISO file. And once the download is over, you can select the ISO file to verify if the ISO file is safe and if it's not corrupted. Now open VirtualBox, then click on New. For the name, select Tails OS. You can select your Virtual Machine folder. For the type, select Linux. And for the version, Select other 64 bit. Now click on next. From here you can select the memory size. For this video I will give it 4 GB of RAM. So change it based on how much memory do you have in your computer. And don't go over the recommended RAM capacity. So you won't affect your main operating system. Now click on next. From here I recommend that you select do not add a virtual a hard disk. This way anything you do won't be saved once you open the virtual machine again. And this is the best way to use this operation system. Now click on create, then click on continue. Now click on settings from system, go to processor. For this video I'll give it two processors. From display, move the video memory slider until the end. And you can enable 3D acceleration. From storage, click on empty. Then select Tails OS, ISO file. Now click on OK. Now all you have left is to run Tails OS. So click on start. And this is the Tails operation system. Select your preferred language, then click on start Tails. You will be using Tor web browser as your main way to connect to the internet. I suggest selection hide to my local network that I'm connecting to Chor, which is safer. Then click on connect to Chor. This is one of the most private web browsers that you can use. And all the softwares and apps on this operating system are powerful privacy tools. And overall, this is one of the best ways to browse the web without any tracking or personalized content based on your search history, your accounts, and your personal information. This is a great way to browse the web privately, but avoid using any personal information or any personal accounts because that way you will make this operating system useless. Again, this is not a, an operating system where you can save your personal files or use your favorite softwares. This is a great way to privately browse the web without any surveillance or tracking online. And in the end, I hope that you find this tutorial useful. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more useful tutorials. Until next time, bye.